Okay, everybody, it's Nala's turn. She uh, just passed her mucus plug, and she's actually moving from the new shed to one of the original sheds that we built. So she's restless. She's going back and forth and back and forth. And you hear the winds kicking up. We haven't even had time to put... Oh, well, thank you, Trilly. You goober. We haven't had time to put any bedding in here yet, so... Jim's gone to get a wheelbarrow full of wood chips and we're going to put some wood chips down. That will give her a, a, at least a semi-absorbent layer. So if she gets up and shifts out, we'll throw it in there. But if she decides to kid in here, then we have to decide if this is where she stays with the babies or if we move her and the babies to another shed. So we're just going to kind of watch her and see how it goes. And yeah, look what I got here. Miss Trilly. Trilly's doing pretty good. She still has a long way to go, guys. Look at that. Still breaks my heart. Absolutely breaks my heart to see her this thin. So, we'll bring you back when we have more to report. She's definitely having contractions. I've been watching her all morning, so very uncomfortable. What was that about? Her udder is so full and tight today. It's got to be uncomfortable. She needs to nurse some babies to take that pressure down. Hey, 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 you two. Stop bickering. Trilly, what are you doing? You trying to be Queen Bee here? Huh? All right, guys. We got more to report. She's up. She might switch sheds. She knew her baby was crying, which is Simba over there. All right, we'll be watching. That was Nala, not me, I swear, guys. <laughs> She's here burping and carrying on. Her labor is getting more intense. So I'm expecting to see some pushing soon. And I just wanted to do a real short update here. Because we're all waiting. We have... Jim blocking the door so nobody comes and goes. Keeping her in here so we can manage the birth. And we're keeping everybody else out to include little Simba. Simba wants to be with her mama, but mama does not want company during this. So it's bad enough we're being we're in here, but Nala is this is her second freshening. And um if you remember last year when she that was an uncomfortable movement, huh? When she um, delivered Simba, we also had a stillbirth with her. And she didn't know what to do because she was a first freshener. Oh, I know, baby. Yeah, it's getting uncomfortable. We're going to be doing as much filming as possible. But keep in mind, if things get a little crazy, I'll end up tossing my phone just like I did with Oreo. And we take care of the goat first. Filming comes second. And we take care of babies first as well. So we're definitely getting close. I think we'll see pushing here within a few minutes. So, but yeah, look at those ears out. Her ears normally hang. That's a sign she's uncomfortable. Look how white she is, guys. Look at that. She's breathing through her contraction. All right. Wait and see game. Okay, guys, just wanted to bring you another quick update. Our contractions are getting closer. Have we been out here an hour with her? Probably. We've been working in the goat pen all day and just kind of watching, but I think we've been sitting about an hour now with her, and her contractions are starting to get closer and closer. So we feel... It won't be long. We'll soon have our next set of babies. We still don't know how many. I'm guessing twins to triplets this time. So time will tell. And basically what we watch now, we're watching for her to tense up and she starts pushing out with his leg like she's putting pressure to uh, offset the contraction. And this will also be how she starts pushing. So that's what we're watching for right now. 
she has no more obvious sign of um, what I call the discharge from that end. She's had at least twice now that I've seen, she's had the discharge. So we know this is active. So it's just a matter of waiting. Oh, if you watch that belly, you might see a baby move. There it goes. See that, guys? There's a contraction. Oh. Are we pushing? Yep, we're getting ready to push. All right. It won't be long now. Nothing out at the back end yet. But we are getting a lot closer, guys. All right. I couldn't have time bringing you back any better. She's definitely getting very, very close. Her labor is definitely hard. We did give, because her labor had stalled when she, right after she gave birth to Simba, her labor stalled for almost an hour. So we've already given her alfalfa pellets, just like we did Oreo. And that helps. It's got some calcium in it, so it actually helps their labor progress because we want to make sure that this progresses and we're doing okay by her and get these babies born hopefully we have all live babies this time see how close together we are now guys very very close if you keep watching that belly you might see some more baby movement mm -hmm. And all that tummy noise is not us. That is her. I don't think my belly's ever growled that high, that loud. And it's not really, it's not that she's hungry. She's well fed. Um, it's that um, her stomach's doing its stomach thing. She's like a cow with multiple stomachs. I'm watching to see if I see the babies move. Oh, another good one. All right, you're okay. We're right here. You're okay, Nella. We're getting real close, guys. Good girl, Nella. All right, she's up. Stretching. Itching. <laughs> Ooh, hard contraction. See how her vulva actually sunk in. She's going, we put some Tums in the mineral feeder just in case, which is another calcium boost for her. Yeah, she's having a hard contraction. I watch her tail. And of course the goats hear me and they're trying to come in. All right, we'll bring you back when we have some more stuff going on. Gloves, my um, scissors for the umbilical cord. Mm. A little goo again. Where the flash? All right. All right, guys, Nala's starting to push. As you can see, I'm sitting right here. I got my pads ready to go. We got some towels here and some towels over there ready to go. So we're ready, we're waiting. It's been a long day. And stay tuned because Bella just passed her mucus plug today. Just about an hour ago, so Bella will soon be going into labor as well. So we're in for the long haul tonight. Nella did eat dinner. We brought her dinner into her. And she didn't even get to finish eating dinner when some of the harder contractions hit. And she's gone into pushing mode. Which is kind of typical for her. That's kind of what happened last year as well. I think right now with the pushing we've seen is getting those babies lined up 
so that when they get closer to the uh, actual vulva area will be when we get some major pushing going on. Poor girl. The babies have been kicking all afternoon. Very active babies. Oh, there's a little one right here. Almost feels like a heartbeat. Could be a vein I'm on, but there's something hard there too, so I'm on a baby. <clears throat> what? Are you still filming? Yeah, should I? Should I st nope, keep going. Keep going as long as the I'd camera will. I was wondering if I ought to come inside there to help. I can't reach anything from here. No, but you have a good filming angle. Good pushes. Big old pushes, yeah. We're starting to see a little bit of fluid leaking. Poor girl. She's passing poop with her pushing, so we're trying to keep things as clean as possible. Don't forget, if you need to, you can pause that. There's a pause button, so just so you know. A little one under my hand again. <laughs> Jim and I haven't had any lunch, no dinner. <laughs> it's been a long day. Nella Bean, how many this time? Good push. Good girl. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good girl. Good girl, Nella. Oh, Ooh, water. For sure. Come on, baby, push that out. She's fine. Just give her time, Dad. See, Dad doesn't understand childbirth, does he? See, it doesn't happen. Our bodies are doing this whether we want to or not. Say, girl. got a ways to go yet. There's no bulge. Just fluid. It could be in that first bubble that usually presents. Mm -hmm. Oh, now she's seat on the pad. She's got a lot of pressure back there, guys. Yep, turned around or something. Yeah, well. Okay, she's up. Definitely has somebody pressing on her bladder. She's got the urge to pee. But not much is coming out. This udder is huge this time, guys. Huge. Hey, we're ready to feed those babies, aren't we? Yes, you are. He's a good girl. Yeah, you're a good girl. Really? You're gonna, it. Yeah. you going to go around the other side now? Yeah, I'll switch. She starts actively pushing again. I'll switch. We're so close to babies. It's crazy. All right, let's 
switching around. You're okay, baby. Oh, more fluid coming out. I don't know. I'm assuming it's just fluid. I'm hoping we got a babies that are going to be in their sack a little bit till they get closer. So that they aren't trying to breathe air while they're still inside her, you know. Mm. That's never a good thing. Sorry guys, I gotta reach for stuff. She shifts, I have to shift all my handy dandy stuff. I got a glove ready to go. I got a glove ready, I got scissors for the umbilical cord and antiseptic wipes if I need them. All right. I think when she's done giving birth, we'll put a layer of fresh hay down. Okay. Got a lot of fluids coming out her back end yet, so. Just gotta get some babies coming. guy for filming her. <laughs> Can you peek on Bella quick? She's standing over here between the... Okay. There's Bella.
out of her. Well, you're so close to babies. Come on, Nala. Hey, Simba. There's some really good bulging going on, so she's real close. Seems like it's been a very long day, though. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> I think tomorrow, Bella doesn't deliver tonight. Tomorrow, we'll just wait all day for Bella and not do any chores. Other than feeding animals. <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> hmm. Don't that. The shed, yeah. Yeah. Looks like a contraction coming. There you go. Push, push. Good girl. Good girl, Nella. Good girl. Good job. Good job. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. There we go. You're doing good, girl. You're almost there. I saw what could have been hooves on the, one of those pushes, so her mm -hmm. bubble's getting bigger and bigger. This is pretty normal from what I, with Oreo and stuff, we went through the same process. Mm -hmm. Now they're going to start hitting her close because she's so close. All right, we got somebody right there, so. Come on, Oreo. Yeah, Oreo. Come on, Nella. Come on, girl. Got a girl. Good girl. Good job. Good job, Nala. All right. Slow it. I see a hoof. Reach behind you there and give her another one. Mm hmm. Don't worry about you. That's what the straw's for, the hay. Mm -hmm. We can't get straw here. But the hay's. I see a hoof. I actually see two hooves. That's a good presentation. All right. Good, 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 good. Push. Atta girl. Good job. Two hooves presenting. That's a win so far. Come on, Nella. I know. I know. Good job. This is a big baby. Mm -hmm. Compared to the hooves from Oreos, mm -hmm. this is a big one. Yep. You can do it. Come on. You can do it. She'll do it, Jim. Just leave her. Right. Little focus. Okay. I know. 
your liquor's kicking in. I know. I know. I know. All right. Don't nibble on my legs, though. I know. I know. Big baby, this is. She may need a little help. I'm not sure yet. But. Oh, you can push. Push, baby. Don't let her bite you, though. She's fine. Okay, I see a, a nose and a tongue. Good job. Come on, Mama. Come on. I see black and white so far. <laughs> Can't go by the hooves. Hooves seem to be all white when they deliver them. Nose in the nose in the mouth is out. She's just got to get the rest of the head, and that's where she might have a bit of an issue because the head is the biggest part when they're coming out with hooves. So I'm gloving up just in case we got to help pull. At least one hand will be protected. Oh, couldn't find my other glove. And this hand has a scratch on it, so we really don't want to get cross contamination fluid. Big baby, Nala. No, it's a little black and white frosty ears. All right, let's get the mouth clear. That's pilot's markings. Mm -hmm. Dang book. Looks like a book. Yeah, I know. Just what we don't need is another buckling. <laughs> Okay, Nala, you're okay. That one's out. Hey, little man. Hey. That was hard on her. I need to get him over to her. I'm going to transfer him to a drive pad. Looks like iodine donuts. Where is it now? Yeah, it is. How's that get wet? Well, if your iodine spilled or if it, I don't know. All right, let's get this baby moved. Let's get her bonding. <clears throat> Clean him up, Mama. Clean him up. I gotta get my trash bag going. Good job, Mama. See if her instincts are kicking in. That's a win. Better than we did last year. He was a big boy. Wow. Uh, 
I gotta be ready for a, cause I'm, I'm pretty confident there's more than one in there. Even as big as he was? Uh, the next one might, if it's a doe, it'll probably be smaller. He's probably the big leader here. Say, the leader of the pack. Yep. Hey, little boy. Hi. Welcome. Welcome to the family. Hi. Hi, little man. He's got some nice big ears. Look at those long ears, Jim. Mm -hmm. All right, we're just waiting. See if she starts pushing for a second. I'm ready to go if she does. You want to cover that? Mess back there to, with paper when we with get, some towels. When she starts pushing again. Not yeah. towels, I mean <laughs> hay. Hay, yes. Hay is a good idea. Good idea. She's having a contraction. Gonna be a good mama this time, huh? You were a good mama when she got started last time. Oh. What do you think, mama? Huh? Oh. Yeah, he's all yours. Oh. Look at that. To him. Yeah. You can pause it in between, okay. otherwise, the video pause. will be super long. All right, we're resuming. You're not going to stay wrapped up, are you? Okay. Okay, we got a bubble. Got hooves. Oh, I see some tan in this one. Oh, nice. This one's just about out already. Wow. Fast. Okay. Let's get your head <laughs> Oh, she's got Mama's stripe on her face. Hopefully it's oh. her. Hopefully. I was hoping for Mama's markings. Hopefully it's a her. Oh, good job. Good job. All right. Is that one as big as this one? Uh, a little smaller. Probably a doe. Mm -hmm. Here, go to mom. There you go. Let me work. Let me get this little one over here to mama. Mm -hmm. Going for a slidey ride. Oh, she's got Nella's markings. Oh, another buck. Yep, oh, boys! Nella! What's up with that, huh? We don't need boys. Boys are hard to get rid of. <laughs> He's cute as a button, though. All right, let's get this covered up, just in case we have to go again. He's got Mama's face stripe. So cute. Yes, you do. You got Mama's face. Mm -hmm. Sneeze it out. Sneeze it out. That a boy. Good job. Good job. You're so cute, you little thinkers. You're a cutie too. You're a cutie patootie. Yep, he's falling in his brother's mess. Yeah, let's not get in brother's mess. In fact, let's try and. Keep brother mm -hmm. here, and you tuck yourself back here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that'll start mm -hmm. warming him up again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that was my last catch pad. Yeah, I was afraid you'd say that. Yep. Where did you say they were? In the, in the cabinet on the stairs? Yeah. Here, you're filming. Mm-hmm.
There we go, guys. Two bucklings. This one has mama's markings mm -hmm. for sure. He doesn't have mama's... Well, he might have mama's ears. Look at mm -hmm. that. They were both good-sized little babies. This little one's over here by me. I got him tucked up against my side with a towel over him because there's a breeze going. And I don't want to get a chill. Success so far. This one came out all by himself. So he's a tad smaller than the other one. He looks kind of curly-coated, just like Simba did when she was born. There we go. <laughs> We've already been able to get this uh, firstborn latched on. He did get a little drink, so... He's feeling pretty good right now. We wanted to get that done so that um, he had a good jump start. <laughs> he's trying to walk. He's behind me, but he's trying to walk. And that's okay, Nala. You work on this one. I'm going to help dry him off as well because we got a cool breeze going. It's been a beautiful day here, but there is a cool breeze. And I don't want him to get chilled. <laughs> two bucklings. We were hoping for all does from her. Last year she gave us two dolings. <sighs> At least the, um, we'll praise. We'll take what we got, guys. They're alive. That's what's counting. So, yeah. All right. I'm going to actually go off for a little bit and try and dry him a little bit. And get ready in case there's a third. dryer yet and that one's quite content already he's nice and warm we gotta get you drier i know you just want to run and play already hey life is just beginning huh? i got mama stripes yes you do you got her face stripes yes you do little man Timba and Puma. There you go. That works for me. I want this one to be Timba. Mm. And that can be Puma. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's got a spot on his side. He's got brown hooves. I don't I don't know what color his belly is yet. in here right now. Not right now, no, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Good mama, good mama. Now I'll lick your mm -hmm. baby, don't lick me. <laughs> Should have had you bring a quart of warm water out. Oh yeah, make her molasses, molasses water. water. Yeah. yeah, she needs that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you want to take over filming? Can we just pause I it for now? It? Okay. Mm -hmm.